Hey everyone, welcome back to Focal News SA. Today, we're diving into the growing rift between the EFF, MK party, and even a few unexpected players. Let's follow up on this. So, an EFF supporter recently took to Twitter after Floyd Shavambu's interview on SMWX, and let's just say he didn't hold back. Here's what he posted. Fighters, I'm tired of pretending. Then, he went on to list his grievances, saying he hates the MK party more than the GNU, dislikes Jacob Zuma more than Cyril Ramaphosa, and even dislikes Floyd Shivambu more than Fikilim Balula. And he ended it with, EFF is my home. This post sparked major conversation, as some fighters are making things personal, calling out Floyd after his SMWX interview, where honestly, he had to defend himself. As someone who usually keeps a low profile, Floyd felt he had to clear up the constant attacks he's been facing from his own party. Oh, away with Petraeus! Away! Away with Petraeus! Away! Sometimes this so-called brotherhood, it's not brotherhood, it... it it borders on gangsterism, a gangster relationship that we're together. If a person is wrong, we can't call each other to order. Sizwi also shared his two cents, saying he could handle Floyd leaving the EFF. But now, it feels like Shivambu's moving like an enemy of Julius Malema. Some folks agree, while others felt Floyd's explanation of their relationship actually made sense. Mm. Like, you defend each other even when a person is doing wrong things, is now venturing into wrong politics of uh, being boastful and doing wrong things in public and everything else, and, and, and disrespecting people, and then you don't say anything because of brotherhood. You must be able to call out certain things, that this is unacceptable and everything else. Then, there's more drama around this post, with some calling it divide and conquer tactics. Meanwhile, an MK party supporter commented that they still respect the EFF, seeing it as a partner in achieving total freedom for Africans. Another claimed the EFF is in cahoots with the GNU and might eventually join them. But before we jump to conclusions, remember, not all EFF members hate the MK party. Some believe both parties represent hope for African liberation. As one user put it, any negativity toward these two parties might just be GNU bots stirring the pot. What's your take? Are we seeing a genuine split or is this all just political heat? Share your thoughts below and don't forget to like, subscribe and stay tuned right here on Focal News SA.